It's windy here in New South Wales. Today I'm doing a video around how do you forgive yourself when you do some really dumb, stupid things. And, and you should know better. I mean, I should know better. I've just been through a divorce. And the mistake wasn't the divorce. The mistake was getting married to the wrong person. But how do you, how do you forgive yourself when you should know better? And then you get yourself in these situations and well, at least I got out. But the thing is, how do you forgive yourself for sometimes just being really stupid? I think the hardest thing in life is to, is to actually do that. And I think the, the, the most important thing is to realize that every person does their best in any situation and time. And there's always a lesson and a reason something happens. You know, you don't just coincidentally have fall into something. There's a reason something happens. And I think the other great thing is time. Time heals all. And being gentle with yourself. You know, taking time out for yourself to work through the experience and to get the lesson. So I think the most important thing about how to forgive yourself is as long as you get the lesson and be gentle with yourself and realize we're all humans and we sometimes just do stupid things. And then while realizing that, also look at what you do have and appreciate what you, what you still have around you and the goodness in the lesson and the goodness in life. So maybe it's a mixture of gratitude and time Gentleness. I'm going to try those. I'm open to ideas. But at the end of the day, I think it's just about being good to you and loving yourself and realizing that we all make mistakes. Anyway, this is Glenda Wendy Shuttleworth. I would love to hear from you. If you have any comments or would like to write, me, write to me, you can get hold of me at wendy at yoursoulpuzzle.co.za or wendy at yoursoulpuzzle.com. Thank you. Bye.